Okay, you can go. Hi, Lily. Or oh, good morning, Lily. <laughs> okay, good morning, Lily. It's Tuesday, and Lois is in Olympia, and you're not because you're in Paris. Well, hello, Lily. Um, Kirsty wanted to do an intro today, so I let her take that. I have to leave for work soon, but I thought I would film just before I go, so this is gonna be really quick. This is just gonna be a vlog vlog, I think, where I just talk about things that are going on without a particular theme. Um, so yes, uh, things are well-ish. Um, school, four weeks of school left, which is weird. Um, and that is a few partial weeks because this week is Veterans Day and in two weeks it's Thanksgiving? Yes? Goodness. Um, yeah. Mommy and Daddy came down and we got coffee and I went to the psychiatrist and um, we walked around Green Lake and we went to Trader Joe's and I tried cookie butter for the first time and it was delicious. And this weekend I went to Olympia to hang out some with some really cool folks. Um, that was super awesome. We ate so many cupcakes. So many cupcakes. I find that I'm getting better at vlogging because I've been doing this storytelling where I um, I have to tell an oral story to an audience. It's usually kids. Now it's my empty bedroom and whoever watches this, but I'm getting a little bit better. I'm feeling a little more comfortable in just talking and telling things. And in a few weeks or so, there will be a special digital storytelling that I'm going to post as a vlog, but it's going to be for one of my assignments, actually, because I like to... Not kill birds, but to do things with one stone, you know, all of that. Um, I made sweet potato cauliflower soup today, and I was considering doing a vlog how-to, but I realized that you would never, ever eat that soup. Ever. I'm obsessed with picture books. This is one that I'm super excited about looking at. It's called Not One Damsel in Distress. World Folk Tales for Strong Girls. Oh, look at that reflection. It's all shiny because it's a library book. Shiny, shiny. I'm also obsessed with this book. It is called Exclamation Mark, and it is the cutest thing to ever cross my path. I mean, it's, it's so cute. He thinks he stands out, but then he meets Question Mark, and Question Mark is so exciting. Question Mark... It's much like me, and asks far too many questions when he meets new people. Anyway, adorable. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Also, It's Okay to Be Different by Todd Parr. I love these books. They're so great. Um, yes. Yes. So, I've been doing a lot of reading picture books, and I've been in the library a lot, as usual. Classes are so-so. They're not totally thrilling, but, um, I'm liking them well enough. Now to the weather. Elephant, elephant, big and strong and gentle and intelligent. Intelligent. How could I feel? Actually, we're having pretty good weather here. Um, we've only had a few really bad rainy days. It's been cold, but nice. And like today was a perfect day to walk around Green Lake. It's been, it's been good. Uh, I got into Homestuck. I can't stop. I can't stop it. I can't. <laughs> I just almost fell off my chair. Um. Oh, and I went to go see this writer lecture at um, the UW, Jack Gantos. He wrote the Rotten Ralph books and um, a few other, uh, more recently, the um, Dead End of Norvelt. Um, and I got his uh, memoir, which is called A Hole in My Life, which is about his experience in prison. Anyway, amazing children's book author. Now, I want to be a children's book author. And so that has gone goals, except I need an illustrator. So, if you want to work on that, if someone else wants to work on that, I need an illustrator, because I can't draw to save my life. I'm a little hyper, can you tell? A little bit. Then some chocolate. So yes, I hope you have a wonderful week. Um, I'm excited because you sent the itinerary for our trip in Paris, when we get to come see you in Christmas, and miss you lots. Um, I will talk to you on Friday. <laughs> It's okay to eat macaroni and cheese in the bathtub. <laughs>